these right here, which are super, super cute, guys. Greasy now. Whoo, girl, it's hot as hell out here. Sister, sister. I'm my business out here like that. What's wrong with you? Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, y'all. So I am on my way to Connecticut, but look at how great things work out. So I need to do a try haul for you guys this week. I was contemplating on doing a collective haul, but now I can wait on the collective haul because this package came in. So when I get back from Connecticut right now, guys, I got to start working. So boom. I do have a lot of weeks to still do. Well, to style and take pictures. So that part of my day is pretty much over. So we are on our way to CT, baby. The car is actually really clean. Let me turn around and say hello to my lovely friends. So, welcome back to another vlog, guys. Miss you so much. It's been a few days. I think now I'm finally caught up to vlogs. So, there will be a vlog going up on Friday this week. It's already, um, it's not out edit or anything, but I'm done with the vlog. Um, I got to do a try and haul this week. I have a hair video going up today. The try and haul will go up tomorrow. I'm going to probably have to pull an all-nighter film. I also like doing a reel as well, so the reel will go up tomorrow for this try and haul. I always do that. So, I have a lot of work to do. Um, the wig last night I styled a whole bunch of the wigs so I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do is tomorrow morning I'm gonna take pictures of the wig and update the website the wig sale is on Sunday so I did give you guys a few days to go ahead and look I mean it's only one wig each so how can y'all be mad at me for that so yeah so I'm on my way to CT it's a basic looking day today I found this wig that I had and I you know curl I washed her last night and she looks really cute. So I put a hat on. I have like a little green jumpsuit on. I put my Louis Vuitton bag on. My brown H&M sandals. And it's like the jumpsuit. It's really cute. It's like a really like earth tone outfit today. So I'll show you guys my outfit a little bit later. No makeup day just because like I told you guys I have a heat rash. I did put sunscreen on just to protect my skin even more. But I have a heat rash on my face. Uh, and yeah. So welcome back to another vlog. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Stay. And yeah. And I don't even, I didn't even realize this to now, guys. I'm leaving next week, so by the time you watch this vlog, well, no, this vlog will have to go up early because I have to drop another vlog before I leave. It's about to get crazy. So I'm going away next week. My camera was just so fucking greasy, guys. So I got myself my iced coffee on the highway. So I'm kind of like parsley there. It's 1224 right now. So I'll probably be in Connecticut around like 1 o'clock, 154. First stop. Let's go get some food at the house. My mom made some food. I'm going to measure everything out for what I eat in a week, y'all know. Dan just informed me that my flight leaves next Wednesday. I bought eight days before I have to leave. Ain't that some crazy shit? On the way to the post office, baby. Can I get the ink? Why would you get them out? Oh no. Okay. It's seven in there. Yeah, I saw So that. give me three. Please. All you have to do is like put water in the ink. Can I get the ink? Yeah, probably these rings are. $59.249. These are the ones I just have in my ear right now. I lost a pair of these, so I'm gonna get them. Look at these mini triple hoops. Let me get these, because I actually lost one. They're only coming from Jewelry. That's bad. 25, I would get those, those are really nice. That's a They're medium. like laminate. I know. That's not a medium, medium's a good size, right? I really like this top. If I had a skirt that much, like a green satin skirt, solid one, beautiful. Like Get it. I like those. Those are nice. What are those? $14.99. Those good. Let's go look for some more. I don't know if I'll have size 9, 10, 8. Probably on the other side. Mm -mm. I doubt it. Mm -hmm. Those are nice. These are nice. I need those. These are classic. 
And look at these cute little reusable bags. You know, I like. Love. Look at this one, dude. It has like real handles too. Oh, and this comes with a little bag. Look at this one. This is really nice. It comes like with a little bag. Oh, there's a little girl. Yeah, but this no, not with that handle. That this one has like a. This leather strap. I don't know if I like the leather strap now. Look at that kind. Of, you don't like this? Yeah, that's cute. Look at this. I like it. Kind of like. You be getting the split top honey wheat. Oh, is this no? This one, this is a honey wheat. You gotta get a honey wheat. Oh no 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 no! I can't use that. I gotta use this right here. Okay. That means new Just get them. <laughs> Dayella, what do I need all those rolls for? Oh, Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I get, right. So right. I'm sorry. Something about getting the white ones is just, <laughs> it's reading get them. Right here, guys. Oh, and it's only $1.98. This. I always see one come back because this one is pink. I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, this right here. Banging. And they also got one wood fire garlic. That sounds really, really good. But I wish they had in the mini size. They got the steak house pan. Oh, look at this one. Bath soap. But I came here to get my oil. So I think I'm going to do... Oh, snap. Okay, guys, so I'm going to get the coconut oil one. This is great for the shower. Oh, they got candles. Where the hell did Danielle go? So here goes their school shopping section. But anyways, I want to look at the lashes and nails. Ooh! They got some pretty nails. When I come to Walmart, I usually buy one of these at least one. These are actually fire. No nail tech needed, period. Um... They really got that much stuff here. Those are pretty. So I guess they ain't got the scripts here today. Which is fine. You got your oil? What oil? No. The cook it? These right here, $5.99, and you get 30 festival rates for traveling. This is a little because it's so organic. Look how small this is. I don't think it's really good. The little mini ones? And I restocked it with my vitamins. Here's our list for today. Oh, this is 80 calories a slice. That worked out. Of course, one bun got to be 140 because it's the whole line. It is better than this.
So my mom made some ducole with poigangue and a little bit of chicken. So I'm about to make me a little measured up cup of rice and chicken plate and I'll show it to you. All right guys, so I finished eating. I'm back in the car. I picked up this drink from TJ Maxx, which is the AHA. Pomegranate and what does it say? Blueberry. Guys, it's actually pretty good. It tastes like bubbly, but it's really, really good. I did get my iced coffee, as you guys saw. Why am I repeating myself about things that I already said that I already did? The iced coffee is already pretty much melted right now. I didn't drink that much of it because I didn't eat and it was starting to get my stomach really rumbly. So I'm done doing all the shopping that I did. Um, I'm about to go ahead out and see Dar real quick. Um, the, I, I did end up picking up an offer from TJ Maxx, but I'm probably going to show you guys everything that I got collectively um, probably on um, next week for next week. Like I said, I'm leaving on Wednesday night, so I'll post up a video. I'll have the video scheduled. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to premiere any of the videos with you guys while I'm gone because I'm not bringing my laptop. So I have a lot of work to do on the weekend, like pre-recording, pre-everything, and then on top of that, I have a week sale on Sunday. So I'm trying. what I'm trying to do is bulk edit um, Friday and Saturday, or Saturday, just bulk edit and edit on Sunday and have the week sale on Sunday and then pack the packages, deliver them on Monday. And then I have Tuesday and then Wednesday morning, which I don't really have that much to do because I bought the toilet trees and stuff like that. So I'm pretty much set. Um, Yo, know, life, time moves fast, 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 fast. All right, guys, I'm on my way back right now. I got a lot of stuff today that I want to show you guys. Um, I got some clothes, but I'm going to save all the clothes and everything that I really want to show you guys before I leave for a haul next week, a collective haul, which I'll probably put up on Wednesday or Tuesday just because I'm leaving Wednesday night. Um, other than that, like the vlog will go up next week, but I'm not going to be able to premiere. I mean, I could premiere the vlog, but from my phone because I don't think I'm bringing my laptop or I might bring my laptop. It depends. If I get a lock for the luggage, then I'll bring my laptop. But if I don't, then it's kind of up in the air. But yeah, so I want to show you guys what I got. I have a pack. Like I said, I got the package earlier from a company. So I got to start. When I get home, I got to try on the clothes, see if I can make outfits out of them and see what I like and see what I don't. Figure out what hair works out with them. Get the hair ready for tomorrow. Wake up tomorrow. Do my makeup and straight to filming. Shouldn't have taken that long. I just charge my camera. I'll put a new memory card in it. And I think we're pretty much good to go tomorrow, so I have a plan. Just got to get to it. All right, guys, so it's been a really busy day today. I ended up filming an entire, well, the trying haul, I filmed it yesterday, but you know how, like, when you film and your makeup start getting greasy, like, some of the clips in the beginning were, like, really nice and flawless, and I felt like my face was looking real greasy after, so this morning when I woke up at 7, around, like, 8 o'clock, I started getting ready, so I finished the video. I just redid some clips. I was so greasy in the talking part, so I had to just record the entire talking part over again because I look crazy. So I redid everything today. I actually ended up finishing this hair video. So I got two videos done today. I'm going to edit the hair video later. I already did the try and haul. I already edited it. Try and hauls are so easy to edit, guys. It's ridiculous. I'm watching my girl, Miss Creative Diva, right now. She has a vlog going on, and my actual try and haul goes up in the next seven minutes. It's like 20 minutes long. Oh, my God. I got to put some edits on it. I didn't even see. Look at it just messing around messing around so I got to do a few things on the video the company will send me the information they usually do and I just wait till they send it to me because they actually organize it and put the um, correct link so I let them do it um, yeah so I'm pretty much very productive I needed to get this stuff done I oh if I didn't mention I did change the wig sale so the wig sale will be the week I get the weekend or the week the Friday I get back so I'll just leave the details in the vlog that's going up tomorrow so you guys will see um, tomorrow hopefully I can get the vlog done pretty early so I can just go about my business so I'm hoping that is the case tomorrow so I could just put the quickly edit the vlog put it up and then just go do the things that I want to do because I don't really get to do anything today but it's about 100 degrees in New York City for the last few days there's been a heat wave and I'm just not dealing with that so I went out a few minutes ago and got a bottle of Menage a Trois. I'm going to give myself a glass of wine tonight because I really didn't eat that much. I had one meal in one um, Nature's Bakery bar, which you guys will see on what I eat in a week. Um, so I'm going to have a glass of wine. And then, I don't know, for dinner I'll probably make like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich or like something like real basic. So, yeah. So today was productive. 
I'm about to get ready. Six minutes till the video premieres. I just fixed a few things. Like I said, the company will send me the rest. I'm not even worried about this shit. They'll just deal with this shit later. So, yeah. So, let's get rolling. It's been a while since I did a try haul. You guys love the try hauls. So, I'm trying to get one up once a week. Next week, before I leave, I will actually film a collective try haul, which you guys will see. I'm going to start filming it on Sunday. Um, and it's going to be, you know, just chit-chatting and stuff like that. So it's going to be real natural, real quick. Not sponsored, so. You feel me? All right now, baby. So my video is up. It's about, it's exactly an hour long. 59 minutes and a few seconds. So it's exactly an hour long. It's a long, long video. It premieres at 8.30 tonight, guys. So make sure you guys go ahead and watch. Um, if you guys don't know, last week's vlog, I didn't even show myself. But I was, I was having like a dilemma with the natural hair. I was like, I actually like it. My hair looks cute. Because you guys know I have a, I have like a real five Head, like it's a five head like both of my entire hand can fit on my forehead so I'm just working on it I really like it my little curls came out so cute so I think I'm gonna start definitely by next summer um, I'll have a nice a full head of curls and I'm probably just gonna start wearing my natural hair because I really thought this hairstyle was cute but of course when I went out to the movies for my solo day I put my wig on but you know it was a good flex. I was actually like mad awkward about posting the picture. I posted a little picture on my story today and everybody loves it. So, you know, that always works out. On um, my dart and dance side was really cute. So look at that little fro, period. So shout out to everybody that was in the chat. Um, today was really great for the vlog. A lot of you guys showed up. So like I said, moving forward, I think Friday is going to be my vlog day. Fridays will be the vlog. I'll get a try and haul in every week and what I eat in a week because I noticed that this is something that you guys like. So. I'm taking things into consideration and moving forward with it. Um, it was really great tonight. You guys don't realize that I actually enjoy talking to you guys. Like, that's why every single video I premiere the video so I could chat, I could talk to you guys. Like, that's actually part of my day. Like, I literally, like, I gotta hurry up, I gotta get home so I could chat. Like, that's why I set it up that way so that I can kind of interact with you guys. And I noticed a lot of you guys notice that. So every single video that I do, I premiere just so that I can have a relationship with the followers. I'm always in here talking to you guys. You'll see it on the chat. So yeah, if you are new to my channel, you didn't notice that. Every time I put a video up, I'm talking to y'all. I'm watching the video with y'all. So I just, I'm telling y'all, I really love it. That's why I do it. <laughs> I'm being honest, like, I be in there, we be in there chatting it up, okay? Just talking. So, even though I'm not vocally talking to y'all, but I'm talking, typing, you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I got early in the week. It's a busy week this week, guys. I have a lot to do. I have to start packing because I'm leaving on Wednesday, so I got to, like, get my life together. And on top of that, I will be vlogging Monday. I'm only going to vlog next week for next... The following week's vlog, which I'm probably going to put up maybe like on Sunday, it'll be like a shorter vlog because I want to get, unless I extend this vlog to Wednesday before I leave. So this vlog will probably be longer before the trip because I want to do the vlog for the trip when I get back. And I might actually split the trip. I might do Portugal first and then I might do France after. So two separate vlogs, I think. So I don't know. But yeah, my hand hurting right now. My arm hurting like crazy holding this camera up. So look at that garbage bag in the back. <laughs> So, I am going to show you guys quickly what I got from Wally World, and I need a, I think tonight I'm doing, like, takeout because I only had one meal today and I'm starving like Marvin. Um, I filmed that for what I eat in a week, so I'm just going to do, like, a light kind of takeout meal and just portion it out, so y'all know the vibe. So, thank you guys, like I said, for watching today. It was really, really nice, like... For the ones, when I see you guys join the chat, then I know, like, people got the notifications. Once I see, a, there's a certain, there's a good amount of you guys that are always here. And once I see you guys appear, that means I know that everyone got their notifications. So thank you for coming every single time back. Like, it's the love for me. All right, guys, so let me quickly show you guys the stuff that I got. I got some Honey Nut Cheerios from Walmart. I did get the Wipe That Tush Flushable Wipes because I'm traveling, and it comes with 30 individual ones in the bag. These are actually pretty good, so I bring them with me on my trips. I got some paper, uh, plastic cups. I thought I'd say paper cups, paper towels, some plates that are already busted wide open. I got my Dr. Teal's Moisturizing Body Oil. This is really, really good, guys. I love this product. I like the coconut oil one. They have the other ones, but the coconut oil one works better. I obviously still coat 
like after I put this in the shower, I still put a coat of, you know, a vino lotion over my body just because, I mean, it's not going to do a real moisture moisturizing. You're still going to have to top coat it. So I do it with some Aveeno. I got some Red Hot. I told you guys this is not my favorite, but this is the only one that Walmart had. I'm still going to go to Target today and see if they got the other one, the Texas Peak. This is not my first choice. I did say that in another video. This is not my first choice, but this is all they had. Now... I was just on TikTok and I saw a dentist talking about how charcoal toothpaste isn't good. But I only got this travel size one for my trip. But I'm about to just go to Target and get another travel size one that's not charcoal based. He's saying that this is going to leave a yellow undertone after a few treatments. So there's no, it's going to be a white initially after one treatment. But after that, if you constantly use it, it's going to cause it to have a, a yellow undertone. So nah. I did go ahead and pick up the Kinder's Buttery Burger Blend. I like that one. I got some Dove Soap Bar for uh, my trip. I also did get some Lysol um, wipes as well. Now, for the vitamins, I do take the Ali multivitamins for women, but I also like to take extra ones. I got B12, D3, C, and Biotin. This one works good for hair and nails and um, skin I take this one. I'm gonna take this one every other day because I feel like when I started taking this during COVID that's when my face started to break out I don't know if that's what it was or it was just a hormonal imbalance but I'm gonna just take this every other day but all these I'll take regularly you guys know the season's about to change it's about the the fall's about to come so you know how people start getting sick around this time around September-ish October-ish I ain't got time for that, especially August too, because kids go back to school and they bring germs home, even though I don't got kids, but just a heads up for everyone else who's watching who got kids, I would try to get my immune system up. So I just take uh, these as extra, even though the vitamin that I have has it in it, I just want an extra support. So I did go to Ulta and I got the NYX Butter Gloss. I didn't know that these were $5. They used to be like $6, but now they're straight $5 at Ulta. I got this spiked uh, toffee, really nice color. I also picked up the ColourPop, so juicy. This lip gloss right here, underrated. When I tell you guys, this one right here is a bomb, bomb, bomb. You guys notice that I always like a pigmented lip gloss. I just feel like it looks better. My lips look juicier like it. So this is the color Beechwood, guys. When I tell you guys this lip gloss is the business, and I think it was $8, yeah, Beechwood. Um, really, really nice, guys. It's like a very pigment. Let me see if I can open this with my hand. Yeah, you can. It's very, very pigmented, guys. Oh, it looks like it busted up. So that's what it looks like. Look at that. Y'all. <laughs> Pop it. And you have to keep the cap on it. Once you lose the cap, it's a wrap. It already started. Wow. Whatever. Dang. That's mad messy. Anyways, so that's what that one looks like. Let me open up this one, the next one, so I can show you guys the next one. Hopefully my one-handed trick. Of course, it got the plastic on it. Wait one second, guys. <laughs> All right, guys. So the top color right there is the one from NYX, Spike Toffee. And then the bottom color, you see that pigment right there on the bottom one? That is the Beechwood from ColourPops. Like, I'm telling y'all, those glosses, these two colors, if you like just like pigment with a little brown liner and like a, maybe like a bottom base mauve color. Oh, look at that. I love Beechwood. Look how creamy Beechwood is. So pretty. Um, I did also pick up a uh, palette from Morphe, the, 30, the 350 palette Supernatural Glow. Um, I think I showed this to you guys in the store. I'm not about to open this up, but y'all seen this one. I probably put it on the side screen. I needed a new palette. Um, I had a palette from, two palettes from one of my subscribers that I've been using lately, but I needed another palette just to bring on my trip. So Morphe pretty much has the good ones. I don't know if there's any controversies with Morphe. I don't care. You ain't gonna find no palette in store for $25. That's pretty good. So these are at Ulta. They're very, very good if you're looking for some cute, supernatural shadows. Very pigmented. Morphe has them at, at Ulta, and it's like about $25, $25, $27. I had a coupon this time, so I got $3 off, period. Um, I also did get a pair of earrings, so you guys know. Can I open this? Yikes. All right, so I got a pair of the double hoops. I actually lost one of the double hoops that I had. So this is a smaller size. Target has the bigger size. I'm gonna see if Target has the bigger size. It's always sold out, but I love a small hoop. So I was happy to find these for $12.99 at TJ Maxx. Very, very pretty guys. So these will be my earrings that I bring with me on my trip this week. Very, very nice. So that's everything that I pretty much got. I just basically got like home things and a few things for my trip as you guys can see. So yeah, so 
I am about to... Alright guys, good day people. It is actually 12.53 right now, so I'm actually working on my Amazon storefront. Now, come to find out that I put the link, mind you, this says that the Amazon storefront is active, but the link that I put up, I tried it like 17 times already. It's You guys are telling me that the link is not working. I don't understand. Then what does Amazon want me to do for real? Like... <laughs> So I did go ahead and update this one. I just, I don't really know what to put there. So I just kept it pretty simple and plain. Added an old picture that I had up there. So right now I am actually, this product image that I have right here, um, I have Canva, right? So Canva, it'll allow you to create, all you have to do is type in Amazon, Amazon products, Amazon search. I do a lot of like YouTube, lifestyle, beauty shop, YouTube intro. You can make an entire YouTube intro. My YouTube intro comes from Canva. Um, I do. I create them by myself. So I typed in anima, Amazon's product uh, image. So they give you these templates right now. So what I'm gonna do is find one that's more like beauty related, and I'm just gonna take like one of them and convert it, like change it up. I'll try to add some of the products that I have in my storefront in that product area, and I'll add them to. Let me say. Sorry, we couldn't. Oh yeah, well I deleted that one, so of course you can't find it now. Like this is up, I put my video with the actual video of me trying on the dresses, which you guys will see in the haul soon. So I did that. Like I showed the Cantu product in this one. It's it's confusing guys, but I'm, I'm figuring it out. So I'm about to make a list of makeup and then like hair things. So I'm gonna create two um, photos uh, or like um, post on I think. Yeah. All right, guys. So shout out to uh, taking pictures and saving pictures. So these pictures are old AF. And I'm looking at my eyebrows like, bitch, my makeup was actually, I'm pretty skillful. So I found exactly what I bought from Amazon, the Beauty Blender, some Real Techniques, and also the Sasha Buttercup. I don't really use the Sasha Buttercup as much. I used it when I was in Vegas because Dar had it. And, you know, it's a very, very good powder. So I did go ahead and leave that as a recommendation. The Maybelline New York, always love that. And some brow gel. So so um, what I need to do now is figure out, um, I like how I'm doing these, like uh, this, but Canva is a very big help. Like I said, you can also put that in your taxes. Anything that you use to create your content is taxable. It's part of the work. So I use Canva, I use PicMonkey, I use Adobe, um, all of those. It costs about like $12, $13 a piece, but that times 12, put that into the expense report. That's how I do it. So I don't know about anybody else, but it's part of work. So. I, you know, it's annoying, but like you got to do certain things. So trying to say, I think this came out pretty good, guys. Hopefully it's something you're supposed to do on Amazon storefront because that makes sense to show me actually using the product. And like I said, luckily I take clips of everything that I do. Like these are still pictures that I took off my camera. So worked out. So I think I'm going to do another one for hair products because I have some other still pictures on here for hair. So I think I'm going to use the same template again. And just do hair and just I like this because it I don't know I think this is cool so I think I'm just gonna stick with this template and stick with the writing right here even though this part is a little empty because it doesn't really matter and do a hair essential hair products and yeah so let's move on. Alright y'all so my camera is about to die so today I basically was productive AF today guys I never sit down and talk to you guys I did a whole entire hair video today too so um today was very productive on a Saturday I don't usually do work like this on Saturday but because I'm leaving I had to but today was very productive. I actually got the Amazon storefront to work this time. So if the link wasn't working, I fixed it. I had to chat with um, Amazon Associates, which works. That's actually smart. This is the first like virtual chat that actually is a legit virtual chat. Like that person literally helped me out. Shout out to Amazon for that. Um, but I got it. The new URL is official Dominique A for my Amazon storefront. So go ahead and check it out. I'm about to be doing stuff on there, which is fun. Um, yeah, so you guys should um, go ahead and click the link down below and shop my Amazon storefront. So this is a wig I did today, guys. Come Look at that. Look at that flip over my... Flip over what? Flip over, hey, look at that guys. Look at that and look at the part. <laughs> I did all this today. Like I cussed, I bleached, tweezed and did all that today. That's why I was so busy today, but. To all right guys, so it is Sunday. I did take my nails off. I'm letting them breathe for a few days before I go to Portugal. So I leave on Wednesday. I won't land there till Thursday morning. So it's a real, you know, I got a few days. I got three days. So instead of making this vlog a shorter vlog, well, not even, it's probably going to be long anyways. I'm just going to pull the vlog all the way to Wednesday, edit the video Wednesday, and then have it up by Friday. I don't want to play with editing times and um, 
Like, I don't know how the internet's gonna be out there, so I gotta kinda do this kinda quick and try to get it done maybe Tuesday night. And then, sorry, Wednesday would just be the vlog of me getting ready to go, like, on the day of the trip. So, I don't know how I'm going to do it. I'm probably just going to end the vlog on Tuesday, edit the vlog Tuesday night, and then have it set up for Friday. So, maybe that's how it's going to go, but it doesn't make sense for me to stop the vlog now when I still got three days before I go. And then I'm going to do two vlogs. I'm going to do a vlog in Portugal and a vlog in France. So, two separate vlogs, just to kind of spread the vlogs out and give you guys more contact because we are doing, like, a whole day thing. So... I'm going to just split that vlog two, two times because I'm going to two different places, all right? So, yeah, so I'm on my way to Connecticut now. Dan's leaving tomorrow because the purpose of us going to this area is because we were going to go, me, Alex, and Dan, you know, we're the, like the new trio. So we usually like to, we did the, our trip to Colombia, so we like to do another trip. But because Dan was already going to Portugal for her job, her job paid for her to go for a conference, uh, we decided, oh, we'll just go there and meet you, and then we'll go to a second location. So this is my first time going to Portugal. I've been to France already. I've been to Paris in 2018. So I'm going to France again, but I'm I'm not going to Paris so you guys will see it'll be really nice um, even if I've already been to France before it's nice to experience the other side the French Riviera is actually very nice guys so and it's summertime here and summertime out there so imagine you know how beautiful it's gonna be so yeah so I'm headed to Connecticut now it's only one o'clock I had we did a lot today we cleaned up the house today I haven't packed my bags, but because I postponed the week sale to 8.20, I have some time on my hands now. Um, I have everything that I really need. I just got to empty out my luggage. All my clothes are clean, so I have clean clothes for the trip, which is a plus. So I don't have to wash anything. I literally just need to empty out the luggage and start putting the clothes in the bag. Tomorrow, I'm going to film a try-on haul, which is a collective try-on haul that I'll have to get up on Tuesday because what I eat in a week is going to go up on Wednesday and a hair video is going to go up tomorrow. So... It's a busy. Hi, how can I help you? Hi, can I have a small iced coffee with oat milk and one equal, please? Small iced coffee with oat milk and one equal? Yes. Anything else? That's it. You can come to the window. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, guys, I had to get my freaking coffee because I, I don't know I feel tired. The ride, the rain just made me feel so, like, lethargic or whatever. So, I had to get a coffee. I'm about to pick up Dan. Sister, 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 I got my own mind. I'm done. Damn, you're picking up everything. I'm just lucky. There goes the can, the can, the can, the I don't know. Look at the little one right there, the 24 hour hold. That's the one I got. I'm pretty sure. With the it's Miles colored. Yeah. The Miles? Yeah, for the North here. I don't think that's going to be good. Okay, so it's Westfield Mall and Trumbull. And we're going to get some last minute things for our trizit. I think we might be getting some food. Oh, they got guacamole. It's Mexican cuisine. How about that? Oh, that is so cute. But the material is like... That oh, way. I love it. I think it's, it's really cute. Even the shorter one. Look at the short oh, one. Charlotte. Look at the short one. Oh. I like the short one is better. I would go there for $16. Is that how much it is? I actually like this one too. They got some cute stuff in here. Oh, this is cute oh, too. Is too. Oh, yeah, yeah. Two by the end Yeah, this is given about the same. It's about the same atmosphere as across the street at Mandy's. But the tops are 50% off. Buy one. She goes, buy one. That's always buy one. It's all fata. Like, these are like club dresses. You going to the club in Portugal? No. That's pretty. This is really pretty. How much is that? Is that satin? Yeah. Wow, I love that. Oh, I'm getting this. $25? Dude, look at it. I'm getting this. $25, that's how much I got my blue one for, and I love the blue one I got. I have a green shirt that I had it on. I wanted to get like a belt to go This is what I've always wanted. Me Sing to Dom. Dom. Let's try the housing. Okay, I might get it. Oh no, they don't like that. 
Because this one is to like, how do you try it? I think you put it through the strings or something. So we met a subby at the mall, guys. Hey, girl. Damn. <laughs> so we went to go check out the clothes. <laughs> I met a subby. Nice meeting y'all. Some of y'all think I don't be in Connecticut, but I be in Connecticut all the time. Y'all be So Universal Thread be having a nice stuff. Look at these pants. Oh, nah. This dress is pretty, this orange tomato dress. I don't like why, why, this, why is this top so wide like that? Oh, actually, it got pockets on it? You know. I love that, I like that tomato color too. Wait, look at the pants she has on. I feel like whenever the models are, oh wait, is that it? No. Like, where are these pants at? With the sleeves, the sleeves is pretty. Yeah. You got that orange, the olive color? No, I... Get that olive color. Let me see. It's I, too big, it's extra large. Yeah. I Damn. tried on the olive one at the... Small, right here. I got the black one. Extra small. I got a medium. Oh, the well, next one's medium. No large? No. Is this a set, dude? This satin one, is this a set? Yeah. I don't know, it's a green top, it's cute. Look at this. Yeah, it's so dress. The new day silk but dress is nice. Why don't you get this one? Oh, this is cute. You like the square neck. Square neck. No, that's not square neck. That's not square neck, this is square neck. Yeah. You have two different ones. Which one? I feel like I might like the square neck. <clears throat> what do you think? This is nice. The mirror's with like I need some linen pants. I don't think it's actually, I they got in green. It's like a pea green color. Oh, 12 bucks? I have the stripe. Should I get that tomato dress with the pockets? How much is it? I think I'm going to get this one. It's this tomato colored dress. I think it's like. 30 bucks. Oh, wow. And it's 20% off of the shoes or the circle card. The purple ones are pretty. What does that mean, circle card? Not you got, not oh, the, you got the app. Card, the app. The... All right, these are the fa my favorite triple hoops, guys, at Target for $7.99. So. Oh, $7.99. I paid $12.99 at TJ Maxx. Yeah. Love these. Okay. I told Nobody told you to wear those shoes? I'm so annoyed. Oh, these are cute. Mm -hmm. This one's really cute. Yeah, we're All right, guys. Me and Dan were on our way to go have early dinner at Mato, which is an Italian restaurant. We seen outside. Uh -huh. They probably don't got no seats inside. So we're going in now. Yeah, we've been classy. <laughs> Oh, I'm looking for Oh. Spicy garlic shrimp. It's a little sea on this menu. Oh, it passion tea. Simple syrup. <laughs> We got a milk craft ice cream on a but why he said no churros? Why would you have that ran up there if y'all don't have that? Mm. 
All right, guys, so here's the ice cream. It comes in a bubble cup, like a bubble cone. And this is from Milk. Oh, damn. Mm. That's a quality ice cream right there. She got vanilla. She love vanilla. Strawberries is a, is a thing. The bin is it's not fresh. No. But why was he sitting his tall ass up as a machine? <laughs> why? Why couldn't they make us a fresh one? Too busy staring and smiling. Yeah! Too busy sitting there staring and smiling. Make a fresh one! That's exactly what it was. I was staring like, oh God. That cone blazing with the... Oh, look huh? at them on the date. Aww. If you're in Fairfield, Connecticut, come to Milk Craft. Okay, last type Sephora plus Kohl's. Lies right at the runway. Kohl's plus Sephora. If y'all don't know, Sephora's merged with Kohl's. So, here it goes. Look how big the sun line is on. And it's huge. Damn, Dan is huge. You didn't get any mini fragrances? Where's the fragrances? Oh, they're right here. Travel size fragrances. The white bands. Oh. Look at that. Guys, I cannot find the shoes in my size. So I decided to pee. My mom about to come downstairs now, and then we about to, I'm about to head out. Don't be spreading my business out here like that. What's wrong with you? Uh oh. Look at her. Hey. Oh, fam. Say hi. Oh, fam, I'm pretty good today. Please show, mama. It's happy, I'm sure. So when we go on vacation, we watch my mom from this camera right here, just to make sure nothing happens. Wait, mama, lock it for a minute. For um. Oh, she was scary. Go for me, Marissa. Love you. Bye. No. Why? Ali. Okay. Love you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Morning, darlings. We're on our way to the Mizzle today. And it is super hot out here, girl, but my hair is laid to the gizzard. When I get back to the house, I do have a try on all to record. I already recorded half of it. I just got to try on the last few pieces. And we are done with that. I have a video going up tonight. I have a try on haul going up tomorrow. And I also have a What I Eat in a Week video go up, going up on Wednesday. Happy day, guys. All right, I'm going to mess myself now. All of this stuff, mess. Whew, you can't even record in peace nowadays. Anyways, it's the bad for making that noise. Anyway, so I went outside today, guys. I didn't get nothing crazy today. Primark just didn't have anything that I wanted. I am doing a collective haul this week, so you guys will see the collective haul. And the stuff that I got from like Zara, H&M, et cetera, et cetera. You guys will see it. It's a very nice haul. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. I styled everything up for you guys. So I did get nails. I restocked on nails because they had some sets that I like. You guys know, I tell you guys that the glossy set is the best set. Look at these pretty natural almond shaped ones. This blush color is so cute, guys. Only $2. I got four packs of these because I like to do natural short sets sometimes in the fall. I also got this one, which is like a really, really nice natural short one as well, too. 
You got to have your black. Black is coming back. You got to have your black set for the fall. So I got two of the short ones. I also found this French ombre. I'm not the biggest fan, but I thought I looked at it. I was like, you know what? It might be something different. So I got three packs of it. It was only $3. So I was like, you know, let's just try it out. It might actually turn out good. And I did not want to not get it and then not be there anymore. So I picked it up. And then I got the classic white ones. Now, like I said, if you're going to buy this from Primark, get the ones that are glossy because they are very sturdy. The matte ones snap in half or they just bend. So these have a longevity. I always get the glossies. As you see, all of them are glossy. I did go to uh, Marshalls and I found the Tip Beauty. You guys know Marshall sells. Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and Home Goods sells the Tip Beauty. Oh, wait, Home Goods don't sell it. Just. TJ Maxx and Marshall. So I got the Tip Beauty. These are two styles that I've never seen. Love this set right here. This marble set. Be beautiful. And then this, you guys know, incorporating the black for the season. So I thought these were very pretty. Only $4.99 a pack. And you guys know $2, $2, $2, $2, $2 and $3. So it was a steal. So I had to restock on some press on nails. These are kind of like the natural looks that I like sometimes. And you guys know I do long ones. But when I like short, I get them short like this. When I tell you guys it looks like you got a fresh manicure, like, uh, trust me. I got some uh, all-purpose solution for my eyes, multiple-purpose solution for my eye contacts, some Allegra because I'm running out and I'm leaving. I also got some travel size Listerine as well. They didn't have the full size of Target, so I just got an extra one for the house just because it's probably going to run out anyways, but it is what it is. I got it. I also got some heavy-duty um, sponges, and I also got the stainless steel scrubber so I can use on the um, cast iron. I did restock on the finished power in the liquid for the dishwasher, and then I got a new uh, Dawn Platinum Power Wash. I'm sorry, I know it's so gimmicky just because it comes with the spray, but these, in my opinion, it works very well. So I know it's a little bit expensive. I think this is like $6, but I'm telling y'all, this product works. Oh, it's leaking. No! But that product works really well. So that was everything that I got today on my little trip out. Tomorrow I got to get my eyebrows threaded and my toenails done so you guys will see that. I am filming tomorrow morning before I get all that stuff done. So I'll try to film all the things I need to film, the try haul, and then we'll head out. Still trying to decide what hairstyle I'm wearing for the trip. I'll probably wear two units. Y'all know I, love this I might actually wear the curly one that I have on now. It's just too pretty not to wear some. You guys shall see. But this is everything that I got from... Primark, TJ Marshalls, and Target. So I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog off today by showing you guys the PR stuff. I'm not even going to show you guys the packing because I have not even gotten to that part right now. I'll probably show you guys what the bag looks like. It's just so chaotic, so much going on, and it's so hot in here. So if you guys hear the air conditioner on, my apologies. So the first package, you'll probably see it right here. So the first um, PR package that I got from one of my subbies, you guys know I leave my PO box down below. Uh, this one is from Patricia. You guys are always asking me about the African print bonnet. Patricia, she's always in the chat. She's the one that sent me this one. So she says, happy belated birthday, Shaley. Um, there's a card in here. And the crazy thing about it, guys, I didn't do the furniture department tour yet, but I already had it in my mind that I was going to change the decor in here. So um, this definitely gave me a little booster. And on top of that, this actually matches um, the chair that I'm getting for my office. So it's kind of like she knew. And you guys know my office theme is kind of just like, you know, fun and crazy. Um, kind of in here is mo mostly bohemian chic. So this works very well. So I was happy that I got this. So uh, her company is called Sador, and she has these really cute cards that come in the package, which is really nice. Now the card says, to the Haitian queen on YouTube, happy birthday. Sorry for the late arrival of your gift. I hope you like the item. Wishing you a great birthday and a prosperous and healthy new year. As your living room has a neutral vibe, I chose our cocoa pillows to suit your place. Thank you for being such an authentic woman and re representing all of us. You are truly a special one and I wish you blessings and blessings. Keep shining, belle madame. Uh, super proud of you, Shelly. Um, Coco, is this a cocoa? <laughs> Sincerely, Patricia. 
and the card is cute although this card may be too late for your birthday it's never too late to wish you wish you a year filled with happiness thank you so much like i said she sent me two of these right here which are super super cute guys and she's right on track with this even in my office i'm planning on doing like a leather chair that you guys saw in one of my vlogs so um this is definitely on theme with it i'm thinking about doing it in here as well too because you guys know i use the denim one from Go look at that combination, this denim with this gold um, hardware. I use the denim one. This one is actually, this pillow cover is actually from Ikea. This goes together so perfect. It, just adding color to it, I am getting like a new rug. So I'm going to do something. Thank you so much for sending this to me because I need to switch things out. And this is the perfect color to switch out to. It's also a very nice fall color with this cognac color as well. So thank you so much, Patricia, for this one. And I believe she also sent me one more thing. She also sent me a mask. If you guys know the bonnet that I have is a, is a sister pair to uh, a mask that she sent me. And I got so many compliments on these masks. So she went ahead and sent me this mask as well, which is very, very cute. So her company's called Sador, guys. Really nice. She has like these nice printed pattern items on her website. So amazing. Thank you so much, Patricia. Alright guys, so you guys know I love the press on nails that I got last time by Nails by Nikki. So she did go ahead and send me another set. Now I did tell you guys the set that I love was at that natural set. So she went ahead and sent me this, well sent me a similar set. But this one has a really cute floral design. Now if I did not mention to you guys already, she has an Instagram and she also gives you like a size chart so if you want to figure out what size your nails are there is a size chart so i'm going to go ahead and tell her what size i am this is the set well kind of i like this base right here and she actually does the base ba the best base color this is kind of like my go-to nail color like i love this nail color so much and she actually added this really cute accent um floral design on it so i'm leaving tomorrow so i'm bringing this set with me on my trip to europe and I'm going to actually put this set on um, probably like when I'm on the plane or something like that. So I'm going to actually wear this set. I have like these little short ones that I had from Primark, which I showed you guys earlier. I love this little short set, but I'm going to wear this just to go on the trip. And then I'm going to go ahead and change into these pretty ones. So thank you so much nails by nikki um i let me tell you the last that she gave me i rewore those twice like i was just like rewearing and rewearing it it also comes with this awesome little kit as well too i think what is this is this a nail glue i didn't see this before what is this well no this might be not, not nail glue this is a nail glue and the filer and stuff that comes in the bag what is this you know me maybe it's like a lip gloss or something some or cuticle oil maybe if I could get the thing out. Okay, here it goes. It is cuticle oil. Perfect. I've been looking for cuticle oil. Thank you so much. I'm going to add that on the nice cuticles and have it all fresh after I put the nails on. So shout out to you for this one. I've never got sent cuticle oil. And I've always wanted to buy it at the store. But every time I go to the store, I always forget about cuticle oil. So thank you so much, boo. Thank you. I always actually at her on Instagram. I've worn her set so many times. Love it. The Haitian set was such a popular set. When I wore it, I did like the little Haitian flag day reel. Everyone was going crazy for those nails so thank you so much boo love your All right, guys so the next box is from milk tips i believe that's the name of the company uh yeah i believe it's milk tips so this is the pr box right here it looks like it's i don't know what milk tips mean so let's see it might be like some bundles or something like that oh no okay so nail sizing kit. So this is another set of press on nails. It looks like I got two sets sent to me. So this is nice. Now she also has the size chart and everything on her. So you can go ahead and pick out your sizes. It looks like there's different lengths. So these are like stilettos and these are the coffin shaped nails. So this one, what's the brand's name on here? Is it? Oh, the Etsy shop is Mink. Oh yeah, Milk Tips. This is really nice. I like how she does this in different shapes. So this is stiletto and this is coffin. So you can kind of figure out what size you are, which is dope AF. Now she sent me three boxes in here. This box right here is just a whole uh, tape. I mean like, yeah, the, the little double-sided tape for the nails. You have your glue, you have a nail filer, a nail buffer some cleaning wipes, some alcohol wipes, and she also sent a cuticle oil as well. I have never seen people do, this is the first time I'm seeing nail companies send this. This is essential to have, guys. Nail oil, if you're gonna sell press-on nails and stuff like that, you need to have a nail oil in your set. Love the packaging and everything. Very, 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 very cute. 
it's a little marbled case right here. It's very cute. So she sent me two sets. You guys know I'm the press on nail queen. I <gasps> wow. I'm the press on nail queen over here because bitch, I'm not paying money to go get no. Wow. Guys. <laughs> Let me read her card. Hi Dominique. I was browsing your content your content and saw that you're enjoying press on nails. My name is Lyrica and I'm the owner of Press on Nail brand Milk Tips. I would love to send you over a few samples for you to try. If interested, please check out my shop on Etsy. Thank you. So let me show you guys the sets that she sent me to try. <laughs> hey, baby! Do y'all see this? Look at these. Girl, look at these structured sets. Even though they're not full sets, trust me, I'm going I'm to bust this down right here. Look at how beautiful these nails are. Absolutely stunning, detailed character, everything about these beautiful all right guys so this next package is from lust for style thank you so much for being you i watch your videos all day long you are truly an inspiration for, of a boss thank you for amazing contact love contact <laughs> love you akisha ashika sorry wow love from a love lust for style so this is her card right here. Very, very cute. Now it looks like she sent me two robes. It looks like robes. I'm pretty sure they're robes. Very robes. So you guys know that I've been like flexing this Eunice hair company robe like it's nobody's business. So I'm thankful. Oh my God, it's pajama set. Oh my God, so cute. Y'all know I'm about to fuck this up. Okay really really i did not expect that at all and you got my size right she sent these to me in a size medium guys look at how luxury and pretty this is so so cute and it actually comes with that guys i'm gonna i'm gonna bring this on my trip guys i'm gonna put this in my luggage as soon as i'm done with this very very cute and actually come not an eye thing a little headband to put your head back or is it an eyepiece whichever way no it's an eyepiece it's a little headband to put on your hair pull your hair back very very cute she also sent me this little louis vuitton inspired one now this luxury baby look at this guys so cute <laughs> and this one comes with the shorts as well and you know what i can see how it's gonna fit too it might be like a little tight but not tight but like you know fit it on me but very cute i love that it is a nice stretch waistband so very very cute i am definitely going to bring these with me on my trip and like i said this brand is called lust for style so thank you so much for this one very great guys you guys know i love a good robe i'm gonna switch it up and even though this is not a robe like a good pajama style i love it all right my love so the last package uh was sent to me from let's see what sent to me so the last package, guys, was sent to me from Seen Bubun. See Bubun? I don't know if that's the name of the company, but I think that's the name of the company. So yeah, Seen Bubun is the name of the company. I hope I'm not. It's not a joke. I'm I'm serious, guys. So that's the name of the company. So this right here looks like it's handcrafted passion twist. So these are the Tiani passion twists that were sent to me. Um, this right here says it's the Tiani pre loop passion twist, six inches, eight packs, one B natural black crochet hair, pre twisted passion twist crochet braids. And it's a new item on their website. So this one actually comes in the pack with a crochet stick. You know, sometimes I actually like to make like little units and my hair actually grew back. Oh, so in the pack guys, she sends you the crochet stick and she also sends you some rubber bands along with some little colorful clips, which I think is super cute. Now, she sent eight packs of the hair, and this is must be her handcrafted crochet. It's handcrafted. Like I said, you guys, my hair kind of grew back. So this will actually be like a really cute little hairstyle. And even if I don't do this, guys, I could probably do like a little giveaway on here for you guys. Do you guys have hair and want to do like little crochet styles? So this is really pretty. Look at these little curls. Oh, my God. This would actually look cute on my hair. All I got to do is... Wait, this might actually look really cute. I'm growing my hair out right now, and it's, it's, it's starting to come out really nice, so... I think that this is super cute, guys. This looks like it's handcrafted. She made this by herself. Very nice. I'm going to see what I can do with these, guys. Um, you guys know I'm not someone that has that type of hair, but 
I could put a little coral on my on my dome and make me like a little you know passion twist look. I used to do crochet videos before. If you guys ever, if you guys go on my playlist, you guys will type in. I did like crochet installs before when I wasn't like so big forehead scared or whatever. But you know nowadays I don't give a fuck. But this is super cute. Like I said, she sent she sent eight packs, and each pack comes with how many pieces in here? About six. So nice. Very nice. I think if I don't use this, guys, I'll probably do a giveaway on here for someone who wants to do a crochet twist. And you guys would just get it as a gift for me. So, And holiday season coming up. So I think this year we're going to do like a lot of gift giving, right? Don't forget, guys, my birthday is December 27th. You got a few months. If you want to send me something in my P.O. box, you can go ahead and send it. So guys, it is about like 9 o'clock right now. I'm ending the video on a Tuesday night. I leave tomorrow at night like like 10 11 o'clock at night so i'm gonna end the video here i'm gonna edit the video tomorrow and at the airport and then upload it thursday when i get on some internet out there in portugal and then you guys will if i could premiere with you guys i will if i can't then you know what it is hopefully you guys enjoy uh this video um i'll be back with two vlogs i'll be back with a portugal vlog and i'll also be back with a vlog from france so hope you guys enjoy this vlog this week and i will catch you guys in a later one Bye, guys.